One of my favorite nativity passages is the story of the Magi from the East at the beginning of Matthew chapter 2. These men of means and great repute saw a peculiar light in the night sky. According to some vague and obscure tradition they had, this light signified the birth of a new and special king in Israel. They could have noted this observation and left it at that, choosing instead to get on with their busy and prosperous lives in their homeland. But they didn't. Guided by this light and the word of God which they heard in Jerusalem, they found the divine king in the arms of his mother Mary in humble and lowly surroundings in Bethlehem. They found him because they believed he was worth finding. They believed that he would make them whole, secure and fulfilled in a way that the things of this world never could and he did not disappoint. As God gave a sign to the wise men, he has graciously and lovingly filled our lives with signs that point to the salvation and riches he has for us in his Son. He has allowed certain things to happen to us, to show us that only he and not what we have in this world is a sufficient foundation to build our lives on. He has intervened in our life with his mercy and kindness when we need it at most, to show us that he is always with us, that he knows us and cares for us like no one else does. Touched by his signs of love and kindness that are new every day, and having received his word that says to us, a saviour has been born. If you believe he is worth finding, then you too will find him. This Christmas morning we are gathering to worship our saviour and king Jesus Christ in our church sanctuary here in Moira at 9.30 a.m. It is our heartfelt prayer and desire that we will encounter him. If God is stirring such a desire in your heart, we welcome you to come and join with us. For the first time are afresh, together we will find the one who is seeking each and every one of us. He will not disappoint. He will make us whole, secure and fulfilled in a way that the things of this earth never could.